So once you have imported your FBX or OBJ file into Unity, you can go to the rig section and then you will see the animation type currently as generic. We will change this to humanoid because it is a humanoid structure and all its bones are just rigged as humanoid. How do I know that? If you click on the model over here, you will see that it has a special bone structure which generally start with the hips. So the first animation type, we can set it to humanoid. Then the avatar definition create from this model. This is because we have all the bone structure in the same model over here. That's why we can create an avatar from this model itself and we don't need to import from any other model. So the next option is skin weights, which basically means how many bones you want to use in order to move a single vertex on your character. Now the whole point we are doing all this is because we want to animate our character, which basically means moving the vertex of our character depending on the animation. So the bones are used in order to animate our character and bones generally move each and every vertex of our character. And those bones were added after the rigging process which I showed you in the previous video. So if we allow more bones to move a single character, it can eventually impact performance. And also Unity recommends to keep the maximum influence of four bones. So we are going to stick with standard four bones. However, if you want to experiment, you can definitely choose custom and change the value of the maximum bone you would like to use. But in this case, I'm going to stick with standard. 